Hi there, it's Ryan here at Funk Motorsport, and today I'm going to be showing you how to fit the B58 Turbo Blanket, which is suitable for the 140i, uh, 240i, 340i, Toyota Supra, and others that you also use this platform. Turbo blankets are typically designed to reduce underbonnet temperatures, making everything a lot more reliable, as well as uh, reducing your air intake temperature. This is hugely beneficial to high performance applications. This is a unique uh, turbo blanket because it covers both the manifold and the turbo in one, so that's the two hottest parts of your engine bay. Let's move on, let's see what we need to fit. Okay, so let's see what's in the packet. So first up, you've got your securing springs, which we'll get to a little bit later on. You've also got the two parts of your turbo blanket. You've got the manifold blanket uh, portion, which is quite large, which first up. And then you've got the turbine housing portion, which is quite complex, but again, it's complex for a reason. Also in the packet, you'll notice there's a product guide. I thoroughly recommend reading that uh, cover to cover. There's quite a lot of information in there, uh, do's and don'ts, and what turbo blankets are all about. Things you may need, I'll definitely recommend wearing a pair of gloves. And this is, this is particularly if you've got sensitive hands, okay? You may need a pair of pliers, a spring puller tool, or maybe just some cable tires to help you try to grab those hard to reach springs. That's it, let's get going. Okay, so first up, we're gonna be required to remove this bracket here. It's quite simple, you just have to reach around and grab the three bolts, one, two, three, and just make fitting a little bit easier. It will be fitted back later on. So again, you'll just be removing the two from the engine block and then one Torx here. And it will just remove just like so. Okay, so once, once you've removed your lower bracket, first up, as always, we're gonna fit the hardest to reach springs first. That'll become a little bit, uh, a little bit more obvious while we've done that a little bit later on. And then you're just gonna to have to, you know, really roughly just try and man maneuver this in place. And once you've kind of got it around the bottom half of the turbo, the easiest way to approach this is to grab the uh, two anchor points and the two springs from here and here. Once you grab that, you can pull that and it's gonna nicely sit the rest of the blanket in place. So I'm just gonna do that now. Once you have that in this position here and you've got the springs in front of you, join those together just so you don't lose them just for now while we fit the rest of the blanket. Okay, so now we're gonna refit the bracket that we spoke about earlier. The blanket is quite thick in this area, so you may need to push it down, but don't worry, in time, the, um, the in insulation will start to spread out and make it a little bit less tight. So first up, just fit the bracket on there. Find your bolt and loosely put that in there. Obviously, I'm doing this by hand, but you're just going to have to find your, your correct Torx Bix and then fasten it to the block as well. Now it's time to fit these two springs, and it's the routing that's very important here. So we're going to loosely attach those and the first one goes around here and the second one goes underneath the actuator arm like you see here and these attach to the anchor points just like so okay so now we've got the turbine housing blanket fitted it's now time to fit the slightly easier manifold blanket as always we're going to start with the hardest to reach places first so on the back of the blanket right here like so and on the other Again, this blanket does not actually need the springs, but they're just there for some ex extra security. You simply slot that over, just like you see there. It could be quite a tight fit, especially between the actuator here, um, but it does fit quite nicely. Get that into position, and you'll notice that that doesn't interfere with the actuator at all there. Now we're gonna fit fasten the springs. Okay, to fit these springs, I like to lift the blanket up slightly, put my spring puller or pliers through, and grab the spring like you see here, and pull that through and fasten that in one motion. Just repeat that on the other side. Once that's done, just manipulate the blanket so there's no creases, it's nice and straight, it's not interfering with anything and you're pretty much done. Please bear in mind, these blankets are both available in titanium like you see here, and carbon fiber finish. They both perform exactly the same, they've just got a slightly different aesthetic, depending on your engine bay. And that's it. That's how to fit the turbo blanket to the B58 Turbo. If you've got any other questions, hit us over at funkmotorsport.com.